The year is really supposed to push you to your limits and make you grow and do so in a way that your base is something that holds true to yourself and coastal resilience is something that I want to do for the rest of my life. I'm Grace Levins. I'm a senior in the geosciences department. Um, on campus, I am an ambassador for the admissions department. I am, well, I was the president of Geo Club, but I'm still an active member. I am in Greek life here, and I'm in the Garnet Society. I learned about the Watson Fellowship um, in some meetings with Lynn Evans, our scholarship and fellowship director. One of the fellowships she recommended was the Watson. And so I said, sure, why not? We started working in August. The application was due in November. I had an interview in January, and then I found out in March. So it's a long-winded process, um, but it really gave me time to develop my project the way I wanted to and make sure that if I ended up winning, I would be really happy about it and excited. But in terms of what the Watson is, it's a one-year exploratory journey, in my mind, um, where the Watson Foundation really sends you out for a growth experience and make sure that you feel supported and that you know what you're doing, but also it's a time for challenging yourself and, and creating a deeper understanding of who you are as a person in the world. I think I've always had a little bit of an interest in the human side of everything, just because it's kind of human nature, like you like to care about other people. But it really was when I took an environmental economics class where I saw that true inter interdisciplinary nature between science and policy and how does that work and how do people have such a big impact on how we treat the environment. I've definitely been more of a hard science person my whole life, but this new piece of policy and economics and also thinking about how people themselves are affected and I mean, on the coast, there's this huge connection to tradition and culture. And so part of my Watson, I hope that I get to explore that a little bit more um, because growing up in the mountains and forest, you don't really have that understanding of what it means to live on the coast full time and raise your children on the coast and, and have all that. Um, so that would be really fun to be able to explore.